So I was playing around with the slow-mo feature on my phone and you actually get some cool results um, in which everything is slower, obviously, but it's also transposed down two octaves, um, which gives you some cool instances. Like if I play this E flat, it'll sound like this. And if I play this E flat, it'll sound like this. And if I play this E flat, it'll sound like this. So it's pretty cool and it gives you some cool options. Um, what I did do is I did the like high B flat scale, but uh, I recorded it. So it'll originally sound like this. But when I record it in slow-mo, it sounds like this. Um, and then you get among some other cool stuff. Um, here's B zero. Um, down two octaves. So that's B negative two, right? Or something, yeah, negative two. So that's pretty crazy. Um, here's me just doing, going chromatically down from F. And I play that, but into slow-mo and it sounds like this. Um, and also the hide and creation solo, which, you know, the beginning is. And it sounds like this.
So some very cool stuff, um, among other things. Um, try playing around with this and have some fun.